Okay, so welcome back. In this video, I will be teaching you about SHL and SHR instructions. So SHL and SHR instructions basically shift the bits of the operand left or to the right. Okay, so SHL shifts the bits of the operands to the left while SHR shifts the bits of the operands to the right. Okay, so it is important to note that the bits shifted beyond the destination are shifted to the CF flag. Okay, you need to take note of this. And then zeros are added to the vacated positions. Okay, so its syntax is SHL or SHR, then the registry or the destination, and then the count or the how many positions do you want to shift the operand by. So let's have an example. So let's say you have move EAX A, H, wherein A is a hexadecimal number. And if you represent that in binary, it will become four zeros and then one zero, one zero, right? Then you have SHL EAX2. So we will be shifting the contents of EAX to the left by two. So one zero, one zero will be moved to the left and then the empty positions, zeros will be added, right? On the other hand, if we have SHREAX2, then we are just left with 10 here, or six zeros and then one zero, okay? But in this case, the CF flag will contain the value one because there is a one here that will be stored to the CF flag. Okay, so this is the SHL and SHR instructions and I hope to see you again next time.